Um, what a battle. Um, what a battle. Emotional day. And, um, boy, it obviously hasn't sunk in yet, but um, been dreaming about this a long time. This is, um, you know, a dream come true. It means, it means everything. Um, and I'm just, uh, I'm happy for our school. I'm happy for the school and our, and our community. And I'm happy for these kids. And I'll tell you, they have worked so hard, so hard, and they deserve everything they get. And, um, you know, hats off to North Farmington. They didn't stop. They didn't quit. Uh, they got pretty physical out there. And, uh, uh, but I don't think it was any, any, any cheap stuff. And it was just a physical game, really, really, really physical game. And, um, you know, we, we came out with it at the end. And, um, you know, we're happy to bring this uh, state championship back to Orchard Lake. So. No, it was a long, long this fourth quarter of my life. Um, it seemed like there was seven guys out there. And when Sherrod comes over and she said, that's fast. When Sherrod says it's fast, it's fast. So, uh, but, you know, we, uh, we weathered the storm, and uh, that's what it's about. You know, and we kept our composure, our sportsmanship, and, uh, and uh, we got it done in the end. But made three throws, what, 17 to 18 in the fourth yeah, quarter? Yeah, it's a testament to these kids. You know, we, we, we talk all the time about pr process and routine with, with, with free throws. You know, if you, if you start worrying about if it's going to go in or not, you know, you're fighting from behind. So, but, uh, you know, that, that's, those free throws are uh, the, uh, uh, the work of a lot of early mornings um, that these kids put in and they, uh, the, the extra time they put in to uh, embrace that. We, you know, just embrace the pressure. You know, that's all you can do. You can't run from it. Not going to run from it. Hey, Trey, are you the best free throw shooter on the team? <laughs> um, I don't know. <laughs> I mean, 14 of 14 today. I mean, it's something you obviously you take pride in. Um, I'm in the gym every day, so that's really nothing new to me. So just being in the gym all the time. Trey, right, you talked about that first quarter, getting 11 points, and then starting that second half, you had another 11 in that first quarter. I mean, um, just the, the zone, when it's in the zone and I get in the middle, um, I have the option to play make or score. Um, I don't feel like anybody can really guard me, so I can score every time where I can play make and I can get to see my teammates because they're open in the zone. You won the stat department. I mean, you had a dozen more assists than them. Uh, you had a dozen more rebounds than them. Uh, you made a dozen more, at least 15 more free throws. Was there any component in the stat book that you were saying, we've got to win this, we've got to win this, we've got to win that to hold up the trophy at the end of the day? Did we win it in turnovers too? <laughs> no. <laughs> no we, we, look, we knew we had to take care of the ball, and um, um, that was the that was the most important thing is we, we took care of the ball and we rebounded, you know. Um, so that, that's pretty much every game now, right? You know, that's probably what we built our – our program on is defending and rebounding, and um, you know that's what we had to focus on today. Todd, can you talk about that? You guys are down by five more early to get that 10, 11, nothing run, and it was put back after put back, second chance, second chance, and a lot of times Jaden would either get a rebound or he'd slap it like uh, to Sherrod, and Sherrod would knock down a jumper. So yeah, like you got a lot of second, third chance out. Yeah, we well when that that zone, you, they get pretty spread out, and uh, you know we crash the backside pretty good there. Um, North Farmington's not a big running team after misses. Um, I wish I could say that was a big part of the game plan, but it wasn't. <laughs> uh, but you know, it's just it's just fight, right? It's just going in there and the will to win, the will to want that ball, and they, you know, these kids they wanted that ball, and uh, you know that's what they did. Some problems and you wasn't able to finish. How important was that early? 
Uh, yeah, um, that was one of our uh, defensive things that, you know, we kind of had to lock him down. And uh, we knew that he was going to get the ball a lot. And so I just knew if I bodied him up and, you know, put my hands straight up, you know, that he wouldn't uh, get all the opportunities that he had. And um, also I knew that he was heavy right handed. So I was just trying to force him to the left. Well, it was pretty physical, and uh, you know, I, I think we, looking back, you know, we, we we tried to look up the floor more. They were really spreading us out and uh, jumping the passing lanes out wide, and uh, we probably needed to be a little bit more aggressive in that situation. Uh, but that's hard, you know, trying to protect the lead and throw cross court passes and greet the ball and you know do all those things you do a hundred times and. And on the biggest stage in high school sports, uh, it's, uh, I don't know if they wore us down. It was just, uh, uh, you know, it's a physical game, right? It was, it was, it was physical. Hey, Trey, you talked about how satisfied, you know, how satisfied you get a chance to do this. Last year, you guys were a surprise team getting here. This time, you know, you got the target on the back all year long, and it was tough, and Man, they just, they tried to take it from us last year. Um, we've been going at it every day, just being consistent. Um, but I don't think it's really sucking in, just winning a state championship. It's kind of crazy. Um, just being a kid from Flint, you know, and it's just crazy. Um, just to execute, and because we knew North Farmington were going to come in and try to play us hard, because we we beat them last year in the playoffs. So just trying to stay humble and just keep keep a mindset to where we, we can win the game. You guys haven't been on this stage. Well, the last time you won the title was in 2000, right? So I can see the raw emotion on everybody's face. You guys come in, and there's tears in your eyes, there's yeah. joy. I would assume. Why does this one mean so much to the program? Well, I don't know if any programs won it in D, C, B, and A now. Um, there may have been. I, haven't, I don't know. But, you know, it's been 24 years. Um, you know, I've been at St. Mary's since I was, I could just walk. And uh, my first memory was 1982 with Chris House and Hiram Harris winning the state championship. And, uh, you know, I played for Coach Porritt, coached with him for 20 years. And uh, it is the hardest sport to win uh, a state championship in the Class A in high school. It is, uh, it's hard. And uh, when you put so much effort and time into something and it, it, it comes true, um, you know, it is emotional. It means a lot, man. It means a lot. Good. Thank you, Coach. Congratulations. Thank you.